Selena from Miss Lena's Kitchen. Wednesday. And uh, this is Wednesday morning. And I'm getting to do another version of my dressing, homemade dressing, okay? But this time, it's going to be uh, the seafood dressing. And um, I'm going to show you the things that I'm going to be using in the seafood dressing, okay? So I will start now with, um, okay, I have the canned oysters. I also have, I have two cans of canned oysters. I have two cans of crab meat. Okay. I have cream of chicken soup. I have cream of mushroom soup. I have onions. And in here, I have put everything together. The bell pepper and the celery. So I have the green bell pepper, the yellow, orange, and then the celery, okay? And then I'll probably will put putting it in, in the uh, cream of celery soup also. I don't know if I'll need it, all of it or not, but if I don't need it all, I won't use it. Okay, so now I will be going to my uh, onion powder, garlic powder, and black pepper, and I'll also have uh, onion, on, onions, just regular dried onions, okay? Okay. All right, so now, I'm, and I have uh, chicken broth. Okay, I'm getting ready to get started, but just give me a minute to say thank you, people. I came on, and I, that's always my first thing to do, is to thank all of my uh, viewers, and to thank my subscribers, and I also thank um, my old subscribers, and I thank all the new ones that has come in in the last couple of weeks, a couple of days. I appreciate you guys so much for coming in and to subscribe to my video, to uh, my, uh, my, my channel. And I appreciate it. But now I would love to say, continue to watch for my uh, videos because I'm going to try to put out more this week. Um, so my first thing to do is to crumb up my cornbread. All right. So I'm crumbing it all the way up. All the way down till it gets to be really crumbs. I've already, like I said, I already made the cornbread. But I crumb it up real small. Okay. Okay, I came back and I, I uh, put the onion uh, soup, uh, the, the dried onions in it. Okay, so now I'm stirring them up. Okay. And I'm going to pull the chicken broth in there. Okay. Now I didn't put it all at once because I'm going to dip in the soup a little bit. Kind of mix it up. But first I'll be pouring it in a, a little bit of the black pepper. Because I like to get all of the uh, lightweight ingredients in before I put in everything else. Okay, and this is my garlic powder. All right, the onion powder. All right, now I'm going to be mixing it up a little bit more. Okay, now I need my, uh, this is my cream of mushroom soup. I'll put it out in at once. Okay. All right, the cream of chicken soup. Okay. 
Now this is the cream of uh, celery soup I will be putting in also. I'm just going to put all the soups in at the same time. And when I mix it up, it'll all be blended in together. Okay. 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 And this is the, uh, the crab beak will go in also. Okay, I have two small cans of crab meat. White, I'm using the white crab meat. It doesn't matter which one you use, whether it's the white or the other one. Okay, now I'll be blending it in and then I'll put my oysters in a little bit later. We had this one day last year. It was very good. Uh, last, I don't know if it's Christmas or Thanksgiving, but we did have it one once last year, and it was very good. Okay. I've already uh, sauteed mm -hmm. all of my uh, bell peppers, onions, and all that stuff. So now putting it in and it's ready to be stirred up so okay now this one I did with uh cornbread um, I usually corn I did this one with just regular cornbread mix I didn't make this from the homemade cornbread so okay so now I'm gonna pull my oysters in okay that's one can of the oysters you can get that ones with the smaller oysters All right, I'm gonna stir these up in here. Okay. Okay, so now I'll put the rest of my broth in. Just. This is very simple for those that like to, uh, the seafood uh, dressing. Of course, you can still use your turkey or whatever else. Just make the dressing separate from the other dressing. So I'm gonna get ready uh, to spray my uh, pan. I think I can use the little pan. Avocado oil. Okay, so it's now ready uh, to get ready to go into the oven. And she used three packs of cornbread mix. And I used one whole uh, bell pepper, one whole green bell pepper, and I used uh, the, ye uh, the yellow, red, and the yellow, red, and what other cup? Orange bell peppers, the sweet ones, the small ones. I use one of each and I cut them up in one small onion. So. That's too much for anything.
and you have just a little bit more, about maybe a tablespoon more broth in there, and I'm just gonna pour it in, and that's all. Okay. She'll be back when it come out the oven. Okay. Okay. This is Miss Lena. So I have took my uh, seafood dressing out of the oven and it's been an hour and I'm going to get a little taste of it. So I want you to see how it's going to be looking. So sometimes uh, they have a lot of oysters in it. So, okay. Okay. Now, if you want it to cook it a little while longer, you can. But this was cooked at an hour. And um, because of the uh, the um, crab meat and the and the um, oysters are already cooked in the can. So, I'm going to take a taste of it. It's very, very hot right now. But I know it's very good. So, okay. <laughs> it is just about too hot for me to put in my mouth. I'm going to have to do a little blowing on it. Mm. It is so good. And if you don't want the extra juice in it, you don't have to put, uh, uh, you can put about, maybe I had the 32 ounce box of, of uh, chicken broth. You can put a little half of that in there. If you if you like for it to be more firmer than what I have mine here right now, so but it is very very good. Mm. It is out of sight. Yes, it is. And if you love seafood dressing, I love seafood. Period. You will love this seafood dressing. It is delicious. When I said it's off the chain, it is off the chain. It just broke the chain. Half and two. So please, please try it if you like seafood. Food, if you like seafood, period. Then you will have good seafood dressing. Because it is very, very good. And I can't stop tasting. It is slow delicious. I cannot stop tasting. Mm. It is off the chain if I tell you. Very, very good. Very, very good. You will love it. I love it. It is so good. Yeah, it's very good. If you like oysters and crab please try that if you don't like the oysters you could always just add the crab it's very good though very very good so please try okay i thank you for watching this video and i hope you will try this seafood dressing from miss lena's kitchen and if there's anything that you need on the comment list please let me know and I'll try to get it on, back on there, everything in line that you need to know about it or asked about it. If y'all want any recipes before Thanksgiving, please let us know in this comment so she can get it done within the next few days. And we appreciate it so much. Y'all have a blessed day, blessed night, or whenever you're watching it. And we will see you later. Bye-bye. Love you.